Yeah, pick it up for Jim. For Jim, I had like a Italian sub and a meatball sub. Oh, cool. Bring the action. What's up, YouTube? Jim out here back in a pot belly subs for pot. Four of six on the Italian subs, manja, manja, manja. This sub is going to be off the charts, guys. But uh, let's get let's get right into it, guys. We're at Pop Bellies here. This is part four of six. We've done Jimmy John's. We've done Subway. We've done Jersey Mike's. This is Pop Bellies. We're gonna finish up at Firehouse Subs. Will be number five. Then the number six will be. The crowning of the Goomba, who is the greatest, the best, the Italian sub. So I got this uh, with a couple add-ons. It didn't come with lettuce, onions, or pickles. I added that. And uh, mayo. Comes with white bread, capicola, Genoa salami, mortadella, pepperoni, provolone and I added mayo, lettuce, onions, and pickles. Cause that's the way I like it, guy. And today is National Sandwich Day and they had a buy one get one here at Potbelly's and I gave my extra sub to my friend Mr. Sub Dana. Manja, manja, manja. It ain't the prettiest sub in the world, okay? It ain't the prettiest. Uh, today's National Sub Sandwich Day. These guys, these guys are building sandwiches back there. They are busy. They can't, they can't make every single sandwich perfect. But uh, if I grab it now, I'm gonna make a mess. So I first need to grab the elusive, the deadly, the invisible napkin. Oh, we're having uh, we're having uh, loose items falling. The lettuce, the onions. It didn't cut all the way through. So let me pull it apart. There we go. This is what it looks like from the end. The uh, bread is toasted. It's hard to see what's in here. We got our lettuce, onions, pickles under here. You can see some of the meats and stuff. This is a very difficult sub to show you all the ingredients. I'll just let you know that they are in there. Let's give it a taste, guys. This is good, man. This is really good. Ooh. We've got a dripper, guys. We got a dripper. This is a really good sub. This is sub number four. The first three have not been toasted. This one is toasted. This is gonna make the, <laughs> the decision that much diff more difficult. Last week, you found out that Jersey Mike's was a 10 out of 10 on flavor. We've got other things to compare to. Um, this was eight inches and 15 sixteenths of an inch. I think it's almost almost nine inches long. The bread is good. It's it's kind of comparing apples and oranges when you have a toasted bread as opposed to the, just the plain untoasted. But this is really good. This is really good. The pickles are those big sandwich pickles. Kind of a. Uh, it's already in the bread, already pressed and crushed in there, so don't, you know, don't complain about the look of my pickle. I don't even know how to You know you have paper plates for when you don't want to do dishes or you have, you have a lot of uh, guests coming over, you don't want to do dishes all night, whatever. You have paper plates. How about when you, uh, you just don't feel like washing your clothes anymore? How about paper clothes? Wouldn't that be a great idea, you know, instead of having to like wash your clothes, you can just, just throw them away. You know, they can make it look uh, classy. You know, just stay away from, you know, flames and, and rain. Yeah, stay away from the heat and the rain, or, yeah. Yeah, you wouldn't, want, you wouldn't want to get caught in a rainstorm wearing your paper clothes, I guess. All right guys, second half of the sandwich. Sorry about not getting a great, uh, 
great look inside the sandwich. It's very, it's very messy. Um, the bread is not soggy. Not very thick though, but not very soggy. Presentation, we're gonna probably deduct a couple points on presentation. But flavor, the flavor is there guys. The flavor is there. Mm. How does mine compare to theirs? Yeah, no comparison. But we're gonna give we're gonna give them a break. Like I said, today is buy one, get one free. They're 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 busy, you know. It was a ten dollars fifty six cents for this meal. Uh, it was a eight inch sub. It came up a little bit bigger, um, but still under nine inches. Um, it's good. Nice bread, nice toppings. Everything was fresh. Everything was good. Um, I would give this a. Ooh, I'm gonna give this an eight out of ten. A very good sandwich. Um, just on flavor alone, I'd say it's probably a nine out of a ten. But compared to the other Italian subs, I'm gonna give it an eight. Okay. Um, stay tuned though. We have one more video coming with a sub from Firehouse. And then video six is gonna to be totally different. It's gonna be really fun. Um, and that will be coming soon. So you wanna stay subscribed for that. All right, yeah. Subscribe for that. You, yeah, good idea. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. If you hate this video, give it a big thumbs down. And that is it for me for today, guys. So thank you all for watching. I love you. And we'll see you soon. Bye-bye. 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 Bye.